Okay, let's see if I can make these steps of the reporting process a little more simple than the last video. Think about it this way. We have selection, rough uh, general selection, sort, column filtering, column logic, aggregation, calculations, more selection, formatting, printing. Those would, might be the simple steps in, in the report process. Let's go through this in a little more detail. Record selection, rough record filtering is simply the process of determining if the master file record is in or out of scope for the report. Sorting is determining which fields on the master file or things that could be joined to from the master file are going to be the keys for the sorted output, the aggregated sorted output, if the report is aggregated. Then you have the uh, column filtering, column logic. Column filtering is determining which, uh, which field you want on the report. It might also include some subselects, which often could be a problem in database world, because you have to put those, those fields into columns based upon more logic, determining if column one is you know, year to date, column two is last year to date, column three is a running balance of some sort. All of those things have selection logic associated with them, often based upon time. Then the next step of the process is the aggregation. That's after sorting. You have to then accumulate balances to higher level balances. Calculations, where we, we, we might have to do some of those at the detail level, some at the summary level. So those are additional processes that have to happen. Higher level filtering, whether you, you want to exclude certain balances. Formatting, determining what, uh, what the format value should look like, what the printed structure looks like, and then creating the, the printed or, or file format output. Those are the steps in the report processes that have to go on.